very few of the 14,000 fans jammed into Mackey Arena here. Even knew where Old Dominion was located when this game began, but they won't forget the Monarchs soon. The Big Ten coach Hans fell behind to the Monarchs 13-9 in the early going, but then outscored them 13-2 after that and went into the locker room with a 33-28 halftime lead. ODU cut that lead to one in the opening minutes after intermission, scoring eight straight points, but Purdue's big 7-1 center, Joe Barry Carroll, finally came alive. Finishing with a game-high 30 points, the third-team All-American was just awesome. With 6.04 left to play, forward Tommy Branch was thrown out of the game for throwing an elbow. Tony Ellis, who played for the injured Mike Ray, also fouled out, but Purdue just couldn't pull away for good. ODU held on to the end, finally losing 67-59, a gallant ending for what has been a storybook postseason for ODU, and things look extremely bright for this young team in the future. This is Bruce Rader in Mackey Arena at Purdue University for Area 10 Eyewitness Sports.